Hey, what's up? I'm Liz, this is Blip City DIY, and I just had something really crazy happen with my PC that kind of freaked me out a little bit, but it had an easy fix, so I wanted to share that with everyone in case, like myself, you have no idea what's going on with this particular issue. So to give you a little bit of background, I was like doing some average content creation. Um, I was actually doing a Raspberry Pi tutorial, and to do that, I was using a capture card to use OBS to record the screen of the Raspberry Pi on my desktop. And while I was doing that, because I record the voiceover after getting all the information uh, from the actual process on the Raspberry Pi, I had a uh, YouTube playing too to like entertain myself while that was going on. And my computer was like really jittering a lot while trying to open up OBS and YouTube was like freezing and it was really weird that this was happening. Um, and then when I actually started recording in OBS, I was getting the uh, error that happens when uh, obviously your renderer is just making your CPU work too hard, which I thought was really weird because I hadn't changed any of those settings. And normally my computer handles all these processes with no problem. Like I have zero issues trying to do all these things at once. Um, and so it was kind of freaking me out. So I did what anyone would normally do. And I, I bring up task manager, take a look at CPU utilization. And it says it's only using 22%. So again, I'm like, this is really weird. Um, but OBS is telling me like my CPU is being used like 60%. And again, like really weird. Uh, so I went further into the uh, performance task manager and saw that my CPU's um, frequency was at 0.77 gigahertz. Now I use an i5-4650 and its clock speed is 3.5 gigahertz, but I have a really good chip. My turbo boost gets me up to 3.8 and change gigahertz with no issue, like constantly. Like this is really weird. And I was thinking like something is wrong with my motherboard or my CPU or something. So I closed out, rebooted, went into the BIOS. I checked the BIOS. It's saying I'm at 3.5 gigahertz, not saying anything weird for power delivery. It's a lock CPU, so I'm not overclocking or anything like that. But I was like, okay, still really weird. Um, so then I booted to the desktop and sure enough, it was still saying I was at 0.77 gigahertz and I was getting like a lot of my programs really chugging along to try to work. So I looked it up on my phone because I didn't really want to use anything on my desktop because I wasn't sure if it was stable or anything like that. So I looked it up and I actually found a thing on the Linus Tech, Tech, Tech Tips forum that um, kind of said like, oh, check your power settings. Someone's having a similar issue and they said, check your power settings. But they were talking about a laptop and I was like, well, that's, I did just change my power settings to balanced because I had been using high performance and having my computer go to sleep when I wasn't in use, but that was causing some problems with my audio card uh, where I was going to sleep so often. So I had changed it to balanced in hopes that that would like keep my power draw like kind of still limited when not in use, but that I wouldn't have the issues with my computer going to sleep and messing up my audio settings. So I went back into my power settings, changed it back to high performance, and I had the, uh, I had the process task manager up and sure enough, as soon as I hit high performance, my CPU went instantly up to 3.8 gigahertz, which is crazy. It's so crazy because in balance, it's supposed to be that your CPU will adjust its uh, frequency when you're using high performance tests, but my computer was not doing that. And I don't know if it's an issue with Windows 10. I don't know if it's an issue with the fact that, as you all know, my computer is obviously built by myself. It uses an ASRock motherboard and other components. And maybe it doesn't have the optimization right now with Windows 10. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. But anyway, I've, I've switched back to high performance mode and I'll keep doing that along with sleep, I guess, because I'd rather have to reconfigure my audio card every once in a while than have my, my programs not run properly. And I even did a test uh, with uh, Adobe Premiere to see if I went to render if my CPU would then maybe boost up in the balance power, but it wouldn't. It stayed at 0.77 gigahertz and it was saying it was gonna take like six hours to render a file. So, I don't know guys, I don't know. But if you're finding this, if you've changed your power settings or you're, you're trying to be more eco-friendly, but you're noticing your computer is just stuck at 0.77 gigahertz, or maybe even if you have a new computer, you just build a computer, it's saying you're stuck at that. Try the power settings, try checking those. So uh, this has been a quick video just to give everyone a heads up that this may be a problem with your PC. 
Um, if you'd like to toss me a thumbs up, leave me a question, comments down below if you've experienced this. Um, find me on social media, all the links are down in the description. And until next time, this has been Blitz City DIY. I hope next time it's like an actual like planned video and not something like this, but I hope it helps people. <laughs>